Our job here and what we take great pride in doing is um, not just saving lives and healing wounds, but also getting people back to where they want to be. And that's kind of how we measure success is if we get you back to where you want to be, then we are successful. Let me tell you a little bit about, uh, about the Arizona Burn Center. It is absolutely critical to our region. Our catchment area is about 10 million people. And as far as we can tell, we're probably the second largest burn center in the United States. If you're burned, you're coming to us. Somebody with a really large burn would be something like 60, 70, 80% of your, of your body burn. And those patients typically will spend three, four, five months in the hospital, and then several months after that in acute rehab beyond just the clinical surgical care of the patient or the nursing care of the patient. We have an entire team that surrounds that patient to make sure that their psychosocial needs are addressed, their spiritual needs are, are met, uh, their activities of daily living, their therapy needs. Our doors never close. We are always open 24 seven and we never say no. Our solution is to prevent injuries as much as possible but then also to take care of them maximally in our community. Dealing with social determinants of health, making sure that vulnerable communities and marginalized communities uh, are served uh, is our great challenge. And we devote our fiber and our soul uh, to delivering that care. The answer to the question, why, why do we need a burn center? We make people whole again. That's what we're supposed to do. And that's what we do.